Am I beautiful? Okay, so today we are going to do a live Bark Box opening. We subscribed to Bark Box when all the COVID shit happened. We had been kind of debating about it back and forth when it was just Jack. Just Jack. And we got Dale and we decided to subscribe for Bark Box. It seemed reasonable for us. And then we actually opened our first box. We're really surprised by all the stuff we got in it. You know, it comes with treats, toys, and then the last one came with costumes. But they were also kind of toys. Like they, they were toys, but they and... were also costumes. It's a good thing we're all in shelter in place because my dad would not have approved yeah. of the costumes. But we're gonna open this one live and see what adventures are in it. And the last one was like the- It was the Oscars, but it yeah, was the- Yeah, the dog version. Yeah, and it was all like old Hollywood themed. It was mm -hmm. cute. Okay, you wanna open the new one? Yeah, we've sat on this for almost a week now. Yep. Just wondering what's inside. So, so it's sanitized. It has been sanitized. Yeah, I think this part's super cute. When you open it, it's a theme. So it says, what's the password? And it's like a pair of eyes sticking through like a little peephole. Each that? one has like these pop-ups. I didn't know if mm -hmm. each one was going to be as cute as the first one we got. Okay. So it's a night at the squeak easy. There, it's a squeak easy. Mm -hmm. So it's a squeak easy. <laughs> That's so funny. So cute. So lots of fun little articles, lots of puns. I love puns. Yeah. You know. And kind of the neat part, just to kind of get on a soapbox real fast, this is all for the humans. Like a dog's not going <laughs> to well, understand. Yeah, no like a dog doesn't understand all this. All right, so we have what appears to be alcohol. But what's nice is they give you the individual name for each toy, so you can go back to the website, and if there's a toy your dog just absolutely loved, you can go back in and buy additional right. one-off items. Okay, so it's a little spider. It's cute. It's a Scooby-Doo trailer. So I, I assume our next box will be Scooby-Doo themed. Oh, it's that's kinda... cute. You love Scooby-Doo. I do. Here's your only chance to get the limited edition. They're all limited edition, apparently. And we get a little promo code out of each box. And anybody that wants to sign up gets some kind of discount associated with it. With you guys. So that, only two toys. Significantly less toys yeah, than last Yeah, significantly time. less toys than but last time. But much better quality. So every box comes with like a standalone like a, what do you want to call this? A chew. Just a chew. And there's only two bags of treats in this box too. So I think they really butter you up with the first box. Yeah, maybe it's a marketing scheme. What we have is the pooch hooch. So it is a, a bottle of hooch. Betty bootlegger. Mm. Just dog puns everywhere. So cool boy. How cool. So we'll, each treat is also themed after the box itself. So we have berry and Clyde, soft baked treats, blueberry and bacon, very neat. And we have duck soup. Duck recipe with pears and cranberries. But it's a lot of treats. It's a good chunk It of... depends how many treats you feed your dogs a day. We don't typically give our dogs a ton of treats. <laughs> like dog treats. They get blueberries and they get table scraps before you call me out, baby. But they don't get a lot of stuff like this. Mainly because Jack is fully trained, so he doesn't really get treats for anything other mm -hmm. than just being adorable and cute. Dale is going through training, but we found very early on in puppyhood that if he had too many treats, we were up all night with Puppy yep. Belly. But this is jerky and jerky is really expensive. I see why we didn't get as yeah. many, but Bark. they are all created by BarkBox. So mm -hmm. like for comparison, this is the one we got last time, which is the best duck Documentary. Documentary. Oh, because they didn't put the word together. Mm -hmm. yeah, some kind of a salmon cut that we haven't opened yet. So lots of good stuff. Definitely feels like bang for your buck. Probably doesn't go very far if you have more than two pooches, but for, for us, it's literally done. But what we liked about the last one, this is literally just freeze dried lamb, but look how small like the bites are. So these, this is what we've been using to train Dale. And you can give him 20 of them before they amount up to one treat. It smells good. Things should I kinda, just be... I kinda do you wanna try that. one? I kinda do. Live? No. <laughs> <laughs> so we are all for BarkBox. I think the six month trial is great. I don't mm -hmm. think a month trial is enough to, to understand if you like it enough no. because I personally wasn't impressed with the toys from the first box. There was one good toy in there. They had was like it? a little, there was like the Grammy trophy. Oh, that's right, with a toilet. tennis ball it attached to it. It was a, it was a, it. Toilet, it was a toilet, toilet. It was a golden toilet with a tennis ball velcroed yeah. on top. And that was cute. We're a big treat family, so the treats are what's important for us out of the box. Is you can get on the website and actually chat with somebody from their customer service team mm -hmm. and say like, hey, these toys suck for my dog. They're not working. Um, so I might just go on there and say, 
hey, we have really aggressive chewers. Can you send us something more durable in our next box? And then at the six month mark, you know, is it gonna be a pain in the ass to cancel if we decide it's not for us anymore? Because I think this is fun when we're in quarantine, but we are big. We go to a really cute feed store locally, but BarkBox was definitely, you know, perfect opportunity for quarantine. If you're actually taking the quarantine and shelter in place seriously, like we are, you miss a feed store or a wide variety of treats, just fucking fun to get stuff in the mail, period. Amazon. Can't say that when stuff comes to your house, you're not excited. It's fun and the dogs love it. I will get the official amount that we spend every month for our six month subscription. Um, so you can cancel at any time, but if we weren't impressed with this box, we were just gonna cancel. Um, but I think we'll keep it going. Yeah. Give a friend his free Scoob box and your next box will be Scooby-Doo 2. So we have this promo code. I don't know if she held it up close enough. If someone actually sneaks in there and snags <laughs> it, then fantastic. You're an asshole. Lucas, you should probably edit out the code so we can actually turn this into a giveaway. Anything else you want to talk about? We've got some just silly stuff that we're doing. A lot of the feedback we got was you guys just like to see us doing stupid stuff. Dylan got a bunch of fun popcorn seasoning. Yeah. We will do a live, so much fun, a live taste test, um, like a movie night kind of theme. Yeah. I know Stephanie asked for a house tour. We're not there yet. See our living room. You can see our kitchen, our beautiful coffee table. You want to try the muffin? We made um, banana bread muffin, and we are big fans of Kodiak cakes, which is protein pancakes and waffle mix. Um, we're almost out of flour and you cannot find it right now. I googled it. Kodiak actually has a recipe on their website that I'm going to list later. Good? No. I think they're good though. Uh-huh. I think pretty good. We're fans. Mm -hmm. All right. I think that's all I have to talk about since Lucas will cut out half of it anyways.